in the game, it was bait, we was gonna be here. Wrote things and then they were up for a rules all year. Life on the estate was, was pretty much just fun every day. From really early teens, we were just so passionate and so into our music that you could kind of see our path was kind of going off in that direction. We never had any idea that we were going to be ending up building a genre, a scene, if you like. Um, it was just something that we were passionate about and we were able to make a difference and, and really change the direction of where UK music was going. That flat just there, um, that's where I met Wiley for the first time, when I was like 11, 12 years old. So many memories around here. The development of, of the Docklands, and we just saw these towers just kind of sprouting up and seeing all these bankers driving through in Porsches, heading to work, um, while a big population of, of, of the people who live around here are on the dole, are signing on job seekers allowance, can't get jobs, drug problems, alcohol problems. It was almost like, inspirational but at the same time like rubbing it in our faces and like I think it definitely spurred us on to want to to want to go and be something this is it this is the basketball court this wall especially is where so much was planned we'd have meetings here we'd decide people were writing lyrics here like, so much happened on this wall and in this, this basketball court. Some, like, of the, the most legendary grime artists have all been through here at some stage, to a video, to a party. Like, just it all happened here, right here. Looking back on it 15 years later, we've, we've managed to, to inspire a, a whole generation who now want to follow in our footsteps. And you've got, you know, the likes of Stormzy coming through as a second generation grime MC and, and literally seeing someone like Stormzy winning at the Brits, best album and best male, it's like, I feel like a proud uncle at home, do you know what I mean? I feel like the UK is, is, is recognised grime and celebrates grime for all that it is. Um, and I, I just like to see these new artists coming through and just take it to the next level, whatever that may be, whether that's blowing up in other countries, taking it international, continuing to have success in the UK. Um, that's what I would like to see for Grime. And I feel like we've, we've, we've worked to a place where it's all for the taking now. There's no ceiling to what we can do. There's no limit.